Hello you lovely lot and welcome to day two. We are all getting ready. It is about half past seven. Um, we're going to meet up with Adam where he's going to call for us at quarter to eight. Luke's not 100% so he's had a bit of a hectic run up to this trip so we're going to let him have an, uh, not let him, that's what he wants, but he can have an earlier start um, today. So we're just getting ready. Uh, Daisy and Luke were sharing the room in the lock off but Daisy you didn't have any bedding on your Murphy bed did you? Well, yeah, I pulled it down last night I was like it's gonna be a problem. <laughs> so I checked this one. Yeah, so we checked this one out and oh how yeah, was it? Was it new roommate? Was it <laughs> was it comfy? So comfy. I always sleep really well at uh, hotels and I sleep really well at Disney hotels. Yeah, yeah you look lovely. Thanks. Can I you can I just oh, thanks very much. Very Are you doing an outfit of the day? Who for me? Yeah, for me, mm -hmm. she like yeah, lift me up and down. <laughs> <laughs> a, but you do look great. Thanks. I've had this since I was about 14 and I've bought it on every Disney holiday. It's a classic. It's a classic. Are you wearing ears today? I am wearing ears. These are my favourite ears I have. I need to get you away from that light. It looks like you stood in front of the sun. Uh, which ears have you got? These floral ones. And you didn't bring your S2 ones, did you? No. They went mouldy. Yeah, I don't know why. I don't think you folded the ears specifically. No, I left them by a window. But I left all of them by a window. And not all of them are mouldy, but the ratatouille ones are mouldy. But it's quite funny because it's mouldy on like the cheese bit. <laughs> so I could have just gone along with it, but I thought, better not. Better not. <laughs> Trace, you're right. You look lovely too. Yeah, thank you. And we're going to Magic Kingdom today. Yes, I'm wearing my Hunting Mansion ears. Nice. And I've actually got a Disney t shirt on. I like this one. I never wear it. But I thought, as we had the Magic Kingdom today, where's my light? Uh, we will, uh, I'll wear that. So, fingers crossed. Getting on Tron today, that'd be mega. Do you know where we're eating today? Oh, Skip Canteen. Skip Canteen. Well excited for that. So excited. And what else we, uh, and then we'll just see how the day pans out. Um, there is a chance Tracy and I might get annual passes today. We're gonna uh, look into it. We're gonna look into it because we get a bit of a discount, Tracy and I, because of having DVC, which is like the Disney timeshare. So um, yeah, we, um, we're gonna look into that because they've just come on sale and I think because we bought tickets in the UK, that price, I think, comes off your purchase price of your tickets, your annual passes, coupled with a DBC discount. Might be a bit of a deal. Anyway, we better get out the door. Right, we're heading down to the bus. Uh, Luke's not with us, he's, uh, he's gonna join us shortly. Morning, Miss Hatton, been very busy this morning, sorting out. Miss Hatton. Mr. Hatton. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> well, from now, Miss Hatton. Uh, and you've been very good this morning. Mrs. Mrs. Nisbet, hello to go by. <laughs> you've got, what have you done this morning? You've got some uh, Tron action going on. Yeah, we've got group 17. I am well excited. I was the pressure. Because I was like, oh, I'm getting, I'm getting virtual queue, not just for me and a friend, I'm getting it for five people. Yeah, that's hard. And uh, yeah, so I was just like, the real test of whether or not I'm a Disney guru or not. Did so you it's safe use, to say I've maintained it. Did you did, uh, use like your atomic clock? Yeah. Nice, I'm well excited for trying. What, oh, so that, what time does that mean we're on it? I think, I, I don't know if it opens at 8.30 because early entry, I think it might be nine exactly. So. Are you excited? Right, Trace, have you decided if you're going to ride it or not? Not yet, I'm going to get up close and personal with it from the floor yeah. and see what I think. Right, we're going to see if it's Disney, uh, Tracy approved. <laughs> it might be, but sometimes I let you guys do a ride first. Yeah. Just to get a, get a feel, because some of it is inside. Squirrel. Some Squirrel. of it is in the dark. From, I haven't watched a POV. Yeah. Right, I'm going to have to keep talking because there's really a few yeah, free yeah, music. I have watched, Lord. I have watched a POV. Yes. Uh, but some of it's inside and dark, so I don't know what happens at that bit. So that's the bit I kind of need you to do and tell me whether I'll be alright with it. We'll find out. So I'm thinking that, but I might be brave, I don't know. Heading on the bus. We are all arrived. It is, oh, it's only 20 past eight. Feels a bit later than that. You know, still a bit squinky because we're not on real money time at the moment. All the buses are arriving. Nice bus journey in. Everyone on the bus was lovely. Had some nice chats. So we're heading in. Uh, Genie Plus is down today. Not sure how that's going to affect us, but you know, excited for Tron. What are you, what are you most excited about that's not Tron? I don't know. I'm just. I'm excited just to be in the park. Yeah? Yeah, I'm feeling it Get already. The feels. I'm getting sort of choked for no reason. And you ready for this one? Alright! 
umbrella, please pull that umbrella out way in front of you just like this, and walk anywhere, nice even pace all the way through. That way, if you look like something that I'm going to be laughing at you all day long, and my colleagues are going to laugh at you as well, but nonetheless, we're still going to have a great time right on down to Have a great day! Whee! Right, we are through security. They have been a lot more security. Very much more thorough in searching of everything. Yeah. A body search is like a buzzer over the body to just check everything yeah. there as well, which they do do enough stuff. Well, yeah. for us anyway. Right, we're in and the train's there. I haven't seen the train going for years. We're just heading in. And it's just, there is just something really special about <laughs> really special about this park that we've been coming here a long time and the kids have been coming with us since we've been coming and they're growing up and yeah it's just it's just lovely awesome first look at the castle for this trip Heading in for coffee, uh, it, it feels very chill here today. Daisy, before you chop that up, can I just... Oh, 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 you just went straight in. So it's Daisy that takes the head off Jelly Baby's first bite. Yeah, you have to end my suffering. I've just got all of the feels, all at once. Oh, the sun's coming out. We got coffees on the firm. We have lovely people. Wish Luke was here. Oh, this is amazing. <laughs> this is this is what it's all about. Every there's just a really really lovely vibe in here today. Everyone's here for the same thing. Amazing. The magic begins. First ride of the trip, Peter Pan's flight. Are you excited for Peter Pan's flight? I love Peter Pan's flight. Are you putting your lipstick on to I'm make sure yeah, you look good for yeah, Peter Pan? Absolutely. <laughs> nice. Right, so it's currently 10 past nine and it's saying that it's gonna be a 50 minute wait. I'm not having that. I don't think it's gonna be a 50 minute wait, so. Um, we don't wait. believe it. We don't believe it. Get it, Daze. <laughs> It's so cool. Oh, oh Peter Pan sneaking through. <laughs> we are just about to head on. I love this ride. And to this point, it's taken 24 minutes. Hello, mate. Ah, oh, thank you. <laughs> Disney ride. It stopped and it restarted. It's that was like, that was like that was a proper launch. Right, we've been called for Tron, so um, we're about to get our Tron on. So it's coming up for quarter two, ten, and the park still feels really light, which is which is lovely. Right, we're heading over to Tron. This ride, I've been anticipating this for such a long time because it feels like it's been being put together for like the longest time. Trace. How are you going to do it? I think you should do it. I think you should do it. I think you should do it. I'll sit next to you. I'll give you a whippy. I think that's the thing that bothers me as well, that you're just, you're on your own. Yeah. 
Oh, all oh, this is new as well. Like, yeah. Oh, and there it is, whizzing around. I am well excited. This whole building looks fantastic. I want to come back and do this at night as well. <laughs> looks mega the whole building just looks incredible and this music that's piped through is like super atmospheric so if you are kind of nervous on the rides as is Tracy and you're not sure about the ride vehicle there's like an area here where you can sit and try them out so you've got some people queuing up just to make sure that they feel secure because for Tracy like being one of the things that she worries about is not feeling safe which you know totally understandable um, so yeah that's a really cool thing to have just there and you've got like a cast member making sure that everybody's happy with it and yeah it looks like he's doing a great job this is like the way the music's building it's really like it's proper exciting I don't think there's anything quite like going on a new ride for the first time Ooh. attention users you are about to be digitized into that's very cool. Team Blue, welcome to the grid. Oh, this looks awesome. <laughs> Done. I've avoided all POVs of that. That was not what I was expecting. That was a proper, a proper ride. I would say, for me, that's a cross between Hagrid's Guardians Rock and Roller Coaster. That, it was amazing, but you, you did well to. Uh, Tracy didn't do it, and I think you made the right call on that because uh, that is a proper, proper ride. Dezo, what do you think? It's amazing. Yeah. It's on the cusp of being too much for me. Really? Oh wow. I don't know. I don't know if it's because I was leaning all the way forward. I was in. I think I maybe should have sat up a bit. I I was a bit more set up. I'd like to try it in the seat that's just a normal seat. Yeah, the back they've got like a like a just a regular seat. Yeah. So if you've got accessibility issues. Yeah. What it doesn't fit in the seat, you can sit in those two seats. Yeah, love it. That was awesome. The whole lead up, the whole music, the whole creature. It's really, really cool. It's way better than I thought it was going to be. And I thought it was going to be pretty good. Yeah, there's like a whole inside element to that ride as well. I thought that was quite like Guardian sort of inside. Yeah, I mean, but I get a little bit queasy on Guardians, but I didn't get that at all in this. I feel fine, but then Adam is fine on Guardians, but felt a bit wobbly on this. I don't know. Yeah. I wasn't expecting it to be as extreme as that. Oh. Nicely timed. Right, it's coming up to 5 to 11. Luke has just arrived. We're going to go and meet him by Space Mountain. But one thing that's worth mentioning, we had... What time did we get in the queue for that? 5 to 10? No. Yeah, 9.55. Yeah. 9.55. And it is now... 10.55 so on and off it, that's, when, you, when you're in the queue it's still about a 50 minute wait from the Is that how long it took? Yeah Yeah, yeah but well, uh, It feels like a lot of the queue is just to scan your magic van Yeah Like we had to wait 30 minutes just to do that Yeah And, then, yeah. and Lightning Lane $20 You're still waiting a long time inside Yeah Because that only, that only skips Scanning your magic band and then a bit outside. Yeah. It's quite a way inside the world. Yeah. 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 So maybe not worth the twenty dollars. No. But what a ride. Yes. Yeah. Right. Let's go and get the boy. Welcome to today's vlog. How are you feeling? Way better. Nice. Hundred percent. I'm hundred percent. Nice. Someone's made a purchase. Daisy. That is. That hat is amazing. I feel like. I should be the next member of Oasis. Nice. I'd probably fix all the drama too. <laughs> we are now heading on to uh, Under the Sea. Uh, Adam's treated us to Genie Plus today. So this is our, is this our first lightning lane with Genie Plus today? Yes. Awesome.
So we've got, we got a lightning lane for um, Haunted Mansion and it's starting just here. Oh, do you think the regular line might be... Uh... Unless it went down. The standby uh, time on it, I don't know if you saw it, is three and a half hours. Is it? No, it's You're not. You're a liar, I am a liar. <laughs> Did you enjoy that? Do you know what I'd like to see? I'd like to see that ride totally refurbished with like super up to date tech. Yeah, I mean, it is what it is. It's lovely, it's classical, but um, yeah, if they did something even more wonderful with it, you'd love it even more. Yeah, really, really like it. It's a nice break from the sun, and although. Um, the bit rude. Um, and, and also. Um, although the lightning lane looked super mental, it didn't take too long at all. And uh, yeah, lovely ride. I say to mum, Haunted Mansion, can you imagine if they did like a, if they did it with today's tech? I was going to say, because how old is that? They're properly old. Yeah, like, how old's properly old? I'm not sure. Oh, like how many years? How old, how long do you think, how old do you think that ride is? Do you know? Uh, 12 minutes? No, how old? How old? <laughs> yeah. Nice. Really? Whoa. Can you imagine if they redid that with like today's tech? They've, they've added some things over the years. Yeah. Say, but, uh, uh, yeah the no, if they did it over again, that'd be cool. That would be amazing. How's it? Hat box ghost later this year. The hat box ghost. Oh, what's that? So he, he, he has a hat box, and his head disappears from his actual face and just um, appears in the hat. Oh, I love it. Hat box. Nice. It's in California. Not here. I'm excited. Even as it is, it's like... It's 1971, so that's mad. But yeah, like, you know, with some refurbs, but you're right, if they did a full refresh with, uh, with the technology we have today, just think of the spooks you could get. Might be too scary, mate. Yeah, it might be. Just stopped to have a memory maker picture taken. That's we, included we with our passes. And they're always really, really good, but every now and again, you get one cast member that just puts way, way, way more effort in, and we saw her in the queue. Yeah, thank you, Alba. She was great, wasn't she? Hey, you know what her surname is? What? Kirky. Albuquerque. Uh, Albuquerque. <laughs> it's not really Albuquerque, is no, it? it's not. I don't know. I didn't ask. No. <laughs> right, we're in Memento Mori for a bit of air con. Oh, would you like that? That is very cool. I don't usually like the, like, themed ride or character with film spirit jerseys, but I love it. I love how sort of vintage it looks. Really cool. Right, we've got some lovely artwork in here as well. Oh, Daisy starting an OnlyFans. <laughs> Only fans? Yeah, it's a fan. It's my biggest fan. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> we are heading in to Pecos Bills for lunch. It's pretty busy in here. It's not like crazy busy, but it's busy enough. So we have decided to use the mobile order. So we don't we're not all over this normally, but we thought we'd give it a go. We have used it before and it's all been ordered. So we're just waiting for our notification. Alright. Done our mobile order, very impressed. Literally ordered it, paid for it, and that took less than two or three minutes. Very snug table, but it's nice, you know, we're all snugged in. All right, I went for the tacos. I've got beef, chicken, and pork. Luke, what'd you go for? I've got nachos with beef. They look good. Daisy, what do you go for? How's it looking? Pretty good. Mr. Hatan? Chicken nachos, five out of five. Five out of five? Well, just by looking at yours, when that came up, I thought you've gone for the winner there. Is it really good? Chicken with like strawberries and strawberry-based vinaigrette with it. Yeah. Yeah, look, yeah, it looks great. We are all done at Pecos Bills. Thoughts? That was really lovely. My salad was so nice. It's good, wasn't it? Yeah. I gave it a four out of five only because um, the onions were quite at the very bottom, there was so much lettuce, I didn't get to the onions till the end to give it a bit more flavour because it just needed that little yeah. bit of like extra. But actually, I'm going to give it four and a half out of five now. Yeah. 
I'm gonna give mine a four out of five. It was really, really good. Um, yeah, we're definitely here again. Adam was saying that it looks like this might end up being a Tiana's might, restaurant. Yeah, they might theme it it's right. Right now, it's so sad, isn't it? happening, but yeah, it's gonna be um, so close, they might as well. Yeah and dinner for four of us uh, well lunch for four came in at 54 dollars which i think was really good value and that included tax we did have ice waters instead of fountain drinks but we do that because we're a bit i am a bit squeaky with the buns also the kids tend to drink more water than anything and you might as well have the free water rather than yeah buy it. and it's not like the swamp water from the drinking fountains it was very palatable but yeah Big thumbs up overall for value as well. Five out of five all round. Because the prices are good. Sorry to come in. The yeah. prices are really good. My salad was huge. Daisy's rice bowl. There's lots of it. Nice place to be in there. Yeah, it was really cool. Very yeah. busy, very noisy, but you know what the places are. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, really, really good. Splash Mountain is having a refurb and it's going to be um, Tiana's um, from Princess and the Frog overlay. But yeah, it's looking, that's, I think, is my like one of my favorite rides of all time so yeah it is looking a bit sad but it is very exciting as well i'd love can't wait to ride that when it's had the overlay we haven't been over here in a long time we got a little we got sort of 20 minutes to to use up before our fast pass for our, well our lightning lane for big thunder is ready so we're going to pop over to tom sawyer's island so to get to Tom Oil Tom Oilers. Tom Oilers Island. <laughs> Tom Oilers Island. Tom Oilers. <laughs> Tom Sawyer's Island. You have to get this little ferry boat across from here. It's over there. It's nice and quiet. They do a slushy on this uh, quick serve here, but if you drink it really, really quickly, you get a, a twain freeze. Oh come on, a Twain freeze. Who wrote Tom Sawyer? Mark Twain. Uh, Tracy, you liked it, didn't you? I it. Can I have a high five? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it just stepped on my shoe. <laughs> Right, we're heading into, uh, oh, it's a bit dark, mate. So there aren't... Are there steps? I'll go in front, do you wanna go in front? I'll go in front. Oh, that's dark, dark. So we find our, uh, oh, found the treasure. Huh? Fine train. Yeah, so we, uh, so this is kind of a bit odd. Trace, thoughts on this bit? Not... I like it now, I didn't like it about a minute ago. It was a really dark walk in here and... <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, it, it's warm and clammy, and the whole thing on the, the Tom Sawyer look. Oh, Tom Sawyer, a dirty old Tom Sawyer in itself. The whole thing on the Tom Sawyer Island. Uh, it's just a walk through. There's no real rides, and it's dark and yeah, it's just a bit of a walk around. Really, it's nice. Uh, so there's like a little toilet area oh, and look at restroom. All those chickens. And <laughs> that's a real horse. Chickens. That looks like a real horse. Daryl's been on the on the bloody wines again. Look at him. It's the middle of the day, Daryl. 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 <laughs> Wake up, Daryl. <laughs> Get off that damn lawn, boy. Heading into the escape tunnel. Are you ex escape? escape. Are you excited? Escape. Let's go. Watch your step. <laughs> Mind your head. <laughs> Luke's just jumped out on Adam. I knew it was either coming my way or his way. And every corner I'm going around, I'm like, who is he? And uh, yeah, Adam took the full force of, um, of Luke jumping out of a dark corner. <laughs> Ooh. It's quiet, too quiet. Clean. Oh my God. I knew it was 
So we originally popped over here for just to kill some time for Big Thunder. I haven't been over to this part, I can't remember the last time, a long, long time. Ended up being a really, really lovely sort of half an hour or so. Yeah, so if you want a break from the parks, oh, there's a really cool area around there if you wanted to just have a, like a little break, picnic, that sort of thing. But for about half an hour, 40 minutes, get away from the craziness of the parks, come and relax a bit, really highly recommended. Thoughts on some sort of island? Oh, it's fun. It's great, wasn't it? Yeah, it's really cool over here, so I'll come up here again. Yeah, team, thoughts on some soil. Like, we came over here to kill a few minutes. I've had a blast. I'd recommend it to a friend. Yeah. yeah. We've had a wonderful adventure, and I think what we learnt was it wasn't about the destination, it was about the journey and the friends <laughs> we made along the way. Daisy, and the amount of Tom Sawyer but, Island. Yeah, 100%. It's fun, wasn't it? Nice! <laughs> <laughs> Heading on to Big Thunder Mountain. Oh, oh no. R.I.P. Lizard. No. You're going to look after, you're gonna, you're gonna look after Mum. I'll try. Right, keep her wedged in. Don't let her rattle about. Wedged. I'm racing myself on here as well. This year's the wildest ride in the wilderness. Yeah! Big Thunder, Big Thunder Mountain. Right, Big Thunder, you're a recent convert. I'm a, I'm a, that's my third time riding it and I love it. Really? Yeah, high five! I think because I know what's happening. So Hold on, well. that was a terrible high five. Because I know what's happening now, sort of, I kind of can anticipate it a bit, but it still surprises you. And there's a, it's such a really good value ride because it's really long. So yeah. You think it's finished and then there's more. It's nice, yeah. Tracy approved. <laughs> I love a parade, didn't you, Sue? But now I'm a big fan. A um, it's really warm, which is, you know, obviously nice. And the time is quarter past three, and we are heading over to Pirates of the Caribbean. So we've got another lightning lane, and it is 70 minutes. That is 70 minute wait, and we got Genie Plus all over it. Yo, 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 yo,
toast to Paris and its many shiny rewards. As a career that we will all drink out of the other show. Nice time on Pirates. Right? It's good, isn't it? It's so good. Yeah. Let's have a look. Oh, they are lovely. Luke, very nice. Thank you. Daisy, let's have a look. Very nice. Mickey's Magical Friendship Fun Fair. Fair? Fun Fair? <laughs> How was that? Fun Fair. Mickey's Airport. Magical Friendship Fair. Fun Fair. We were very close. That was great. I liked it. Yeah. Yeah. Very nice. Very wholesome. All the kids liked it. Oh, I loved it. There's a few moments that get you as well. It's just like so. Oh. That's right up your street as well, oh, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. I loved it. Right, are you ready to go and race some cars on Tomorrowland Speedway? Well, yeah, but how are we going to do this? Because there's five of us. You can only get two in a car. <laughs> you don't want to do it either, do you? I'm like, I don't mind sitting this one out. <laughs> <laughs> Right, we are going to go and race some cars. All right, we're just about to head out. Are you happy with your setup? I think so. I think looking at the weather, I think if the rain might come in at the end of the race, but we've got full dry setup because I think even if the rain does come in, it's going to be pretty late on. So we've got dry tyres on, dry setup. Might take a flick off all round just to soften it up a touch. Um, but I feel good because we tested in the wet yesterday and it felt good, so I think wet or dry I'm pretty happy. Okay, and are you worried about any other any other drivers? There's a couple of new names on the grid this year. There's a, I don't want a name drop, so feel free to edit it out, but there's an Adam Hatton on the grid. I think it's Antonio. <laughs> and he's, like, the rumours are saying that he's a real maverick. He's out there to just fire people off. Dirty driver. Dirty driver. Dirty driver. Well, good luck, good luck. And uh, let I good... I am a bit dirty, but you don't know why I'm a bit dirty. <laughs> It's been a change right. of plans. Okay. I'm, I'm giving Daisy tuition. Right, okay. Right, so Adam's going to be driving. So Adam, we need a good, a good clean start. Get ahead and just make your car as wide as possible. Elbows out. Yeah. We'll back them up. Yeah, yeah. There's, there's no such thing as a clean start. It's a dirty start. We're going to run people off the road if we have to. I'm coming out, I'll be in top. So I don't care. Let's do it. First prize. I want the grand prize. How much do I win? Bragging rights. I can't pay the bills for dragon rights, mate. <laughs> right, good luck. Right, go, go, go. Oh, that miles by. All right, we're, we're gonna win this, don't worry, mate. We got it hit, we got it in the bag. Right, keep it tight on the corner. Power, power, power. I'm going for it, I'm going for it. <laughs> Right, for a little bit of sport, we're going to let them catch up because they're very slow. Right, we'll let you catch up, we'll make you feel better. Congratulations, we've done it. I, I'm predicting a shunt. There we go. <laughs> we are heading into Skipper Canteen. I've never eaten there before. Adam's eaten there a couple of times and rates it highly. I'm really excited and getting a bit peckish and the weather's coming in and just saw some lightning over there. So uh, our timing is spot on. Oh, it's 
really cool. Huh? Oh, this is lovely. Spicy chili sauce topped with crispy pork, pickled <laughs> so mustard greens, the radish menu. and cucumbers. <laughs> Get a look at this, mate. So you've got the appetizers over here. You've got the fried rice. <laughs> See, I, that, I missed that the first time. I was reading through it and I thought, oh, there's no picture for it. it looks an absolute treat, though. <laughs> Separate menu for the entrees, very interesting. Menu. Going over to the entrees, we got some lamb chops, we got some curry vegetable stew, some chicken, some char suey pork, some hanger steak, and some fish and some noodles. All looks lovely, and it's just a really lovely room to be in. Right, there's Adam's falafel. There you go, incredible. This is, uh, this is my bread, they smell amazing. Luke's um, fried rice, how is it? Really good, the prawns are awesome. Really? And they're massive. We've had a good old share round. Everything is fantastic. The bread's amazing, the falafel's amazing, the shrimp's amazing. Ooh, just had something spicy. How good is the food? Everyone happy? Yeah, lovely. And the room that we're in is really sedate and we can hear each other talking. It's, yeah, we should request it. Yeah, what's the room called? The C room. The C room, yeah. Like C S E A, yeah, it's lovely. Right, the mains have come out. I've got the lamb. Looks and smells lovely. I know we both like the portions are massive. <laughs> uh, you got and we got three lots of taste like chicken. Yeah, yeah. And Daisy, what did you go for? Right, food all done. Absolutely fantastic. I'm, we've all been around the table. Everyone enjoyed their meal. Luke, do you enjoy your meal? That was absolutely terrific. Tracy, do you enjoy your meal? Dezo, especially as your veg don't eat meat. And, yeah. You said that was one of the best uh, veggie experiences. Right up there. Yeah. Like, there was a lot of variety. Awesome. Nice, Adam. Yeah, they're good. Yeah, good chicken, chicken, very nice and crispy. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, lovely. Yeah. Well, everything was spot on. I'm going to give it a four out of five, as everyone else did. Service was a little bit rushed at the end, but they are trying to turn tables. But it was awesome. Thanks very much. No, all good. Thanks very much. Cheers. Thank you. you currently find us in the world's busiest shop. Well, it's been raining, so everyone's going to take It's pretty hectic in here, and it's cold, but they have got really lovely merch, as you might expect. This is so busy. You love it in here, don't you? So busy. Stomach. <laughs> right, in the posh bag shop. Tracy's got previous in here. Uh, yeah, all the nice stuff. <laughs> Hi. Hello Luke. <laughs> yeah, we need one with just like crazy cat lady there. I think it's really cheap as well. Well that one would be dirt cheap. Yeah, that's only 328. That's dollars, so like, that's what, like 20 quid? today how's that it's brilliant it's good day wasn't it did you enjoy your day at the magic kingdom i had a very magical day at the magic kingdom magical day look i had a magical day it was really good magical day adam the best that was a great day wasn't it really good day yeah really really good day right heading back to the resort it's all aboard oh. <laughs> all aboard Back in the room, um, we were just talking about our meal yesterday at Haleo's that used to be Bongo's, which was 
Gloria, we believe, was Gloria Estefan's restaurant, but I'm glad it's Haleo's now because we ate at Bongo's and it was pretty average. No, and I've been thinking about those chicken fritters from Haleo um, that we had last night all day. I think there should be a stand at every Disney park that just sells them. Send them in, put them in a little bag, you can wander around, have a munch. Um, but yeah, speaking of food, that meal that we had at Skipper Canteen, how good was that? Yeah, really good. Yeah, it was really good. Really good. The room we were in made it, I think. I don't think I wanted to have been in the room that we first went yeah. through. It was a bit busy. Yeah. The other thing about that restaurant is you could have been... If you were in that restaurant, you wouldn't know what... You kind of didn't know what park you were in. So, yeah, it was really, really cool. And the bill for all five of us came in at... We get a discount, so we had a QVC discount, so um, QVC? <laughs> a DVC <laughs> discount, and that came in at 21.52. So in total, that was 223.29 dollars 29 for a meal for six of us. We added a tip on as well, um, but that was for a meal for five of us. Sorry, uh, and we all had starters and we all had mains, and yeah, really, really good value. Tracy is chilling now. I think this is the end of Tracy's evening. <laughs> We've just been upstairs with Adam and checked out his room. Funnily enough, same as ours. Um, Luke's running around in his drawers, don't know what he's doing. Uh, and Daisy and I are just deciding what we might do. Right, it is quarter past eight. Shout out to Pop Century for how blooming fabulous this place is. I mean, have a look. Roger Rabbit. Big old sports walkman. Uh, I had one of these, but look, it's even got like the power lights. Have you seen the power lights on it as well? Yes. Um, right, Tracy is done for the day. Luke is done for the day. We tried to get Adam to come to Dizzy Springs with us for an ice cream, but guess what? He's done for the day. It was a big day though. It was a big day. I don't know how we're still going if I'm being quite honest. I do. What? Ice cream. Ice we, cream. We, we had ice cream in our heads. No ice cream. Ice cream. Right, so we're heading to Dizzy Springs. Bus was here, top tip, warmest seats are at the back. Ooh, which is good on a kind of chilly night like tonight, but not on a hot day, no. It's kind of cold. Huh? It's kind of cold, it's kind of chilly. Oh, I love it here so much. Oh, imagine if this was just on your doorstep. You just come out here, just relax, all the vibes, everybody's happy, it's awesome. Right, Salt and Straw, my favourite ice cream shop. They do say they have like classic flavours, uh, <laughs> but it, it's weird, it's all like fish eggs and olive oil, that classic, olive oil, balsamic and black pepper ice cream. Uh, but they do do like less adventurous stuff, so we're gonna head in. Right, so here are limited edition, but like black olive brittle and goat's cheese. Uh, classic flavors, let's have a look. Uh, yeah, they, yeah, yeah, salty donut guava and cheese. I'm calling you out, it's not a classic flavor, but it is delicious. I'm not sure if that one is, I wouldn't be ordering that. I'm going for the honey marshmallow rocky road, and Daisy is going for Pineapple coconut. Oh, I'm interested. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try that. Yeah. Huh? I'm gonna try it. Go, girl. I'm gonna. Go. <laughs> Here's mine. It's delicious. How's yours? What's really cool is you can just they actually like encourage you to try them and have samples. Um, and it's delicious. The service in there is amazing. It's not cheap, so these both of these came to like $17, but it is a proper treat and it's mega. Right, we're gonna eat these, do a bit more browsing. Right, we like hats. I like hats. I have loads of hats. I never wear them. <laughs> I bought a hat today. Will I wear it again? <laughs> Stay tuned. <laughs> <laughs> Yeehaw! Howdy! <laughs> yeah, that's uh, that's a bit extra. That one. I feel great. <laughs> right, heading into all things Disney. Do you want anything? 
Disney related, this is where you're gonna get it. You're not a fan, are you? This is there anything on the back? Let's go see Swindon Town play <laughs> and go to the pub some beers. Let's have a look at the back. Is there anything on the back? Yeah, it's quite. It's a bit random. Uh, what number is it? Twenty-seven. Twenty-seven. Luke's uh, racing number. Uh, yeah, there was something about that and Oswald the Lucky Rabbit. We did. We did look into it, but then we forgot. We better do a bit more research. Right, we're playing a guessing game. Monorail. I would say two hundred and fifty dollars. Ninety-nine dollars. I think it's pretty decent. Yeah, I think it's pretty decent. How jammy is that? Walked up. Bus was waiting for us. Days I think it might be quite a busy one. It could be a busy one. It is coming up for 10 o'clock. We are back at the resort. Daisy, are you a bit tired? I'm really tired. <laughs> so we are going to get an early night. Thank you so much for following along today. Where is my light? Um, please remember to like and subscribe. It really does help. Um, so stay safe. Be kind. <laughs> Look after one another. Cheers. Cheers. Is. Cheers is.